Okay, this is the old time rock and roll, the part for the violas. Now I want you to look at your key signature, and you're going to notice you have three sharps there in that key signature. You have the F sharp, the C sharp, and the G sharp. Okay, so let's start up here on our A string. We don't have too much work on the A string in this song, but if we did, we have A, B, C sharp, D, and E. That's finger pattern one. On the D string, we have D, E, F sharp, G sharp, A. Finger pattern three. And then on the G, we have G, A, B, C sharp, and D. Again, finger pattern three. And if you have a G, you can't play an open G because there's a G sharp in your key signature, so you have to play the C, uh, we'll look around here, you wouldn't be able to play an open C if it was called for in the music because we have a C sharp in the key signature. So there you also have C sharp, D, E, F sharp, okay, and a G sharp. So you have everybody a whole step apart there, okay, whole step to one, whole step to two, whole step to three, and a whole step to four. Okay, now this is going to be a practice speed, okay, it's not going to be as fast as we'll be taking it. Now also, I want you to notice, there's a number of naturals in this piece. The natural is going to cancel the sharp, okay, so you go back to the plain G natural or C natural, whatever they've got the natural sign on, but that's generally what they're going to natural or cancel the sharp for. So, here we go. One and two and ready, go and two, three, four, two, three, four, rest.
Só, eu vou dar a gente, eu vou dar a gente.